Okay, let's see. Now, I did notice this little quest I could do. What are you doing out here? Challenging you to a game of Summoner's Court. I think it's time you faced a real opponent. Outside of Ronan's little lesson in charms class, Summoner's Court isn't just a game. It's a battle of skill. A test of a witch or wizard's metal. What say? <laughs> Lol, does he know? I'm in. Let's do it. Brilliant. Summoner's Court, the ever changing game. It's oh, pretty good. Nothing to it. Yeah, I know. I know. I just uh, I haven't done it. Yet. I thought it's just I have to do it every time I switch clothes. That's just too much. <laughs> that was one for the ages. Yeah, it was. Lol, does he know? Try to beat that. Oh, too much. Didn't think you were a match for me. Akio. What? Um all in the wrist. Can I knock this this stuff out? Akio. We are loose. I'll let you have that one. Wait, did I win? I won! Shit. I'm playing you again. Don't get any ideas. <laughs> we should have bet a few galleons on that round. Care to go again? I'm game for another round. Grand. You could use the practice. Summoner's Court. The ever-changing game. Akio. I didn't know they would pounce you like that, okay. Nothing to it. Well, I'll like, try to go for Akio. Or fifties. That was one for the ages. Akio. Try to beat that. Yeah, no more playing around this time. Not bad. Not bad. Akio. All in the wrist. Hmm. I just need 20, right? Akio. There you go. I win. Well done. You beat me. Bit of good luck, that's all. Come now, Leander. There's no need for that. Fine, you're good. Better than I am, at least. I'll let the others know you're good enough to keep playing. The others? I lost seven matches in a row to Samantha Dale. The others who play Summoner's Court thought that if you couldn't beat me, you wouldn't be enough of a challenge. Chin up, Leander. Keep practicing and you'll get better. I suppose you're right. I'll let the others know that your metal's been tested and that you passed. 
Bit. <clears throat> okay, let's see. Okay, let me. I need to try to. Hmm. Why can't I change the resolution? It's kind of weird. If I go windowed, 1080p, and expand this, no. I think it was better off just leaving it on auto. Well. And then cap frame rate. All right, what's next? Yeah, I still gotta do that. Collect troll buggies. Uh, or troll bogies. We're trolls, though. Yeah, I wanna do this quest. Or assignment. So if I go to the forest, I should be able to just use it quickly. Yo, Rocco. I'm on the PC. I like to go over the PC. Um, oh, why am I crusty? Holy shit. I guess that's what the potion does? <laughs> uh, I have a... I have recommended spec plus a 3080 Ti instead of a 1080 Ti, so... I figured it'd be good enough. I'm getting like 50... 55 FPS. Granted, I'm playing on 1440p with the DLSS. I was trying to see if I can play at 1080p. Maybe I should play window 1080p. Actually, I'm gonna try that. I was I was trying to see if I can play full screen, but it keeps defaulting me to 10, to 1440. But how's it going, Rocco? It's been a while. Hmm. 
Move to the US soon? Pog you? Oh shit. Oh, it does? Uh, are you going to uh, which coast? Or, yeah, what area? Yo, same coast as me, let's go. West coast, best coast. I'm not in SoCal, but um, I'm, I'm close-ish. Yeah, dude. <laughs> Dude, this game is uh is chugging everyone's PCs right now. You need like a minimum oh, sixteen gigs of RAM and all this crap. I'm kind of hoping drivers get released right now, or tomorrow when it's actually released. Is it a Hogwarts Legacy game ready driver or just a, another update? I, I, did, I, I do have the newest one, but I didn't see it was game ready for Hogwarts Legacy. How are your assignments coming along? I completed your assignments, Professor. Good. You should be ready to learn to Pulso. Let's see what you can do. Concentrate. Do not let your mind wander. Are you serious? Oh my god. You've got it now. Akio! And I think you should. Perhaps best not to go flinging your classmates about the halls. I suggest having a go at the enchanted books here. Revelio. Well, that doesn't help. Accio. That was an interesting class. Thanks to you. Wasn't precisely what I had in mind, but it was still brilliant. I appreciate your help. I hope Sharp wasn't too disagreeable when you handed in your potion. I heard him talking about taking responsibility. <laughs> I have a decent PC, I think. It's just that I, my, my CPU is 8th gen. It's at the Mecha Minute spec. 16 gigs. But 3080 Ti, I think I am CPU bottlenecked here. Oh well. Professor Sharp was annoyed, but we sorted it out. No harm. Cheers, and you, Eric. How's it going? He probably had a good chuckle after we left. Sharp may seem gruff, but I'd bet a few galleons he blew up a potion or two in his day. Best be off. Next time we talk, I promise. Fewer explosions. Hey, the key. Follow the key. I don't know when I'm gonna like next have a full fledged upgrade on my PC. I need to get Alhamora spell. Yo, Dark. Oh yeah, um, let's... Fix my gear. Okay, what is this assignment? Remus Tentacula... 
Require. How are you? I thought I did that. Require and use a Thunder Brew Potion. Hmm. This is a lot of homework, dude. Alright, let's go to the classroom. Once you have completed the tasks I have set for you, I would like to teach you Descendo, useful for pulling objects to the ground. Yeah, I think I... you are ready to learn Arresto Momentum, the slowing charm. It allows you to freeze objects or people in midair. Simply complete a few tasks and then come and see me. Complete the tasks I've given you, and then meet me in my classroom to learn to fit. At first I thought that loading symbol was like... Me getting stuck trying to open the door, and I walk away and it opens, but I guess it turns out... Um, yeah, it's actually a mini loading screen. I have a lot of homework, Dark. I, I am slacking on my studies. Immensely. Welcome, everyone. I see you've already met some of the many beasts we study in this class. Though be advised, none of these creatures should be taken lightly. They are all in their own way dangerous. Especially if one does not know how to handle them properly. Now, it seems many of you are out of practice. Let's take some time to review the basics of how to care for a beast, shall we? Miss Sweeting, would you please assist our new student with the lesson today? Yes, Professor Howen. Hello, I'm Poppy, Poppy Sweeting. Don't worry about Professor Howen's speech. She over-exaggerates sometimes. <laughs> All the beasts in class are perfectly safe. Oh! Miss Sweeting, pay attention, please. <laughs> The tongue of a puffskin can be a slippery devil. Uh, yes, Professor. Here. You can practice on Gerald. Just keep an eye out for his tongue. <laughs> you can use my brush. Just be gentle. Oh, and think pleasant thoughts. Sign a brush? I have to sign a brush to a... Uh... All right. I think it okay. enriches his experience. Okay. That's lovely. I'm sure he feels much better. I think he might be hungry. Would you mind giving him some beast feed? Beast feed? I don't know how beast feed on me. What do you suppose the pellets taste like to Gerald? Pudding, I like to think. I think we can safely say that Gerald likes you. That's good news. He seems very nice. He is. Kindness is one of his best qualities, right after ambition. And cleanliness. Good work, everyone. Now, let's make our way to the pens and select another beast. And please, do be careful as you feed and groom them. Miss Sweeting, why don't you show our new student to the measles in the farthest pen? This way. The measles are over here. What is that again? Looks like a... 
Oh, couple of knees or whiskers ought to get me a few canuts at least. Enough to buy something from Honey Jukes. <laughs> Kitten knees. Stupid thing. Oh. What in Merlin's name are you doing? Tus tus, peculiar poppy. Worried about a worthless little rodent? Her name is Persephone. <laughs> Her name is Persephone. <laughs> the Raven <laughs> That's really not funny. Bruh. <sighs> Let's go. Steel whiskers. <laughs> Those two don't belong anywhere near this class. Poachers in training. Persephone was on to them instantly. Thank you for your help. Let's carry on. Feed and brush the measles just as you did with Gerald. Now I gotta brush a weasel. I mean, measle. I mean, what? <laughs> the measles really took to you. They know a good egg when they see one. As do I. It appears our time has come to an end. Please close the pens and see yourselves out. Now, where is our new student? Right here. Ah, there you are. I would like a moment, please. Hello, Professor. You wanted to speak with me? I did. How did you find your first beast's lesson? It was wonderful. I believe I'm really going to enjoy this class. Good. You seem to understand that when beasts are properly controlled, they can play a vital role in our lives. Some provide us with magically imbued materials, if cared for correctly, which does not include torturing them for whiskers. Well done, by the way. Probably best to let me handle it next time. Yes, Professor. They're nearly as bad as the savages in Rookwood's poacher pack. Sadly, we're the ones who suffer, stumbling over dead beasts. Terrible waste of resources. Surely the poachers can be brought to justice by someone. The Ministry, perhaps? Hmm. An optimistic idea. Now, why don't we focus on more immediate matters that we can control? Professor Weasley has asked that I prepare some assignments designed to help you catch up to the other fifth years. Be on the lookout for my owl. Meanwhile, I also encourage you to study as many beasts as you can on your own time. I need Sounds to good. To Come here. Do you need something, Poppy? Thank you again for saying something to those brutes so that I didn't have to. You were an augury at noon in the desert. I certainly hope that's a good thing. It's something my gran and I say. It means that something or someone is a welcome surprise. At least that's what we decided it meant. I couldn't stand there and watch them harm the poor thing. We're of a similar mind. Actually, in light of that, there's someone I'd like you to meet in the forest. Should I be worried? I'm not sure. What's this all about? You'll see. I promise you have nothing to fear. I wouldn't take just anyone there. In fact, you're the first. Really? Well, thank you, I think. As I said, we think alike. Pleasant surprise. the weather we're having, don't you think? Poppy, where are you taking me? It really is much better if I just show you. Don't worry, we're nearly there. It's just ahead. <laughs> Stand back. It's Hippogriff. We get to five. Fuck week now. Oh, 
please meet High Wing. Isn't she just magnificent? <laughs> Go on, introduce yourself to her. But be careful. Oh, it's 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 fucking. You must beak. always show hippogriffs the proper courtesy before you approach them. someone this quickly you can feed and brush her if you'd like i come and check on her every once in a while bring her pasties tell her what's going on in the car pumpkin pasties you wouldn't know from looking at her but she's a dreadful busybody oh we gotta feed her uh. i guess eat the same food Never mind. What? You don't get to fly? You did the bow and everything. So, what did you think of High Wing? I don't know, I could think of the fly it. Honestly, she was a bit intimidating. She does have a rather stern brow, doesn't she? But look how well you put her at ease. Are you the reason students have been seeing hippogriffs flying above the Forbidden Forest? Hmm, perhaps. Did you know that once you earn a hippogriff's trust, they'll always be there for you? I've seen it firsthand with her. How exactly did you and Highwing cross paths? It's a longer story, but I rescued her from poachers a few years back. Got her to safety and, well, she was fine until recently. You may have noticed that poachers are something of a problem in the area, so I worry they could get her again. And that I might not be there next time. Professor Howen mentioned the poachers as well. She seems to imply that we couldn't rely on the Ministry to help. I don't often agree with Professor Howen, but on that, I fear she's right. The poachers' influence is growing. I see them every day in the village, lingering, talking to people. They're up to something. I'm just not sure what. Well, the game forced me to, so yeah, cause I had to. It was the objectives. But yes, I guess I just somehow have feet in the brush that on That does me. seem strange. Sounds as if they're planning something. Exactly. I think I'm going to look into it. Find out what's going on. What they're doing. I think that's a fine idea. Information is power. And the more I know, the better I can keep Highwing safe. You seem undeterred. Will you let me know what you find out? Oh, very well. I will. I should be going, but we'll speak again soon, I hope. Just out of curiosity, let me turn off the OSS. I mean, I'm fine with just playing the um, character. Yeah, I mean, yeah, backseating, only do it if I ask for it. Otherwise, it's, I'll find out. Hmm. Should probably grow a mandrake in the room requirement. Let's do this one then. Yo, Normandy, how's it going? Yeah, DLSS is not doing anything right now. Because I'm playing at 1080p, I think. No point. Does it get any more cozy than Hogsmeade?
Hello there. Nice to see you. Hello, Miss Ryan. I wanted to thank you again for your help with Rookwood and Harlow the day of the troll attack. Serona, please. And I was happy to help. Oh, those two are nothing but trouble. Glad you and your friend were here when they found you. I am too. You were speaking to a goblin here that day. Yes, Lodgog. He's a friend. It seems as though you were on good terms with him. I've known him for years. We met when I was waiting tables here as a student, well before I bought the place. He was cordial enough, but we weren't friends then. His mistrust of wizard kind ran deep. But you're friends now. We are. I hadn't seen him in years when he came in a few months ago. But he recognized me instantly, which is more than I can say for some of my own classmates. It took them a second to realize I was actually a witch, not a wizard. Not all goblins are like Ranrock and his loyalists. Lodgok is as worried as the rest of us about what's been going on. In that case, I'd like to talk with him, about Ranrock in particular. Where might I find him? I assume your interest is to do with the rumors I've heard about Ranrock working with our friend Rookwood. It is. If he's not here, you might find him doing business at the Hog's Head. He's a trusted metal trader. Hog's you should mention that we spoke. He can, understandably, be wary of witches and wizards. Even ones as young as you. That said, if you're looking for information on Ranrock to help rein him in, you'll find an ally in Lodgok. Have you heard what Ranrock and Rookwood are working on together? Not much more than the fact that they seem to have some sort of uneasy alliance. Friendship between wizards and goblins is rare enough, but between those two, they each want something the other has. I can guarantee it. That said, I fear they're like a two-headed serpent. Both will need to be taken down to stop whatever scheme they've been plotting. You seemed unfazed by Rookwood and Harlow the other day. They don't scare you. They're bullies, plain and simple. Never tolerated them in my own life, and certainly won't tolerate them going after my friends. Don't misunderstand me. They're dangerous wizards and shouldn't be trifled with. They should, however, be confronted and reminded, whenever possible, that the rest of us have each other's backs. Thank you, Serona. If you find Lord Gog, please give him my best. I don't know what you've Never done to make such powerful Lord enemies, Gok. but please... Rebellio. Watch your back. What's this? Yes. What are you boomsticks? Oh, I'm chugging still. Hello. Good to see you outside the castle. You too on Alright, maybe I should turn it back on. Oh my god. Welcome to the Ogs Head. Any empty seat is yours. I'll take that drink. Ultra performance looks too bad. Terrible. It's just too performance. Hello, Lord Gok. Serona said I might find you here. She did, did she? Did she send you with news? No. Actually, I wanted to speak with you. It's about Ranrock. Now I remember. The three broomsticks. Day of the troll attack. You're the student he's after. I am, and I need to know what he and his loyalists are up to, so I can stay a step ahead. Let's say I did know. Why should I trust you? Serona trusts me, and she thought our interests may be aligned. Hmm. Well, if Serona trusts you, very well. I may know of something that could help us both. A way to get Ranrock to confide his plans to me. I'm listening. Years ago, a heinous witch stole a sacred goblin relic. Rumor has it that it now rests in her sarcophagus, in a tomb accessible only by wizard kind. 
Ranrock and I had a, a falling out a while back. The relic could well repair the chasm between us. Mm. Very well. Sure. I'll retrieve the relic if you promise to share Ranrock's plans with me. We will have to trust each other. I, that you will not abscond with the relic, and you, that I'll share a great word. what I learn. Gather whatever supplies you may need, and meet me near the witch's tomb. Abscond's a great word. I will abscond. What? I can't jump over this? There we go. There's too many invisible walls, man. This is open world. Let's, have, let's jump ready. around. Good. There's no time to lose. What precisely is the relic I'm to retrieve? A valuable heirloom known as the Helmet of Ertgot. The witch considered herself a collector and purchased the helmet as a trinket. She cared not what pain she caused the goblins. Goblins believe that the rightful owner of any object is its maker, not its purchaser. Wizard kind see things differently. It's a wonder goblins and wizards have ever been able to work together. The differences between our kinds are myriad. They seem to be. It may surprise you to know that I do not believe those differences always to be insurmountable. It is the reason I find myself traveling with you to this tomb today. There's a Merlin child we can do. After this though. And there it is, the witch's tomb. Dreadful looking place, isn't it? Handy resource indeed. You're I wish you luck retrieving the helmet. As a wand carrier, you should have an advantage. Now, before you set off, do you have any questions? What about this helmet makes it so special? The helmet of Ertgot is an ancient and storied relic, forged during a time of unity among the goblin clans. It inspired greatness, that is, until it was no longer ours. Then it became something else. A symbol of what has been lost, of all that wizard kind has taken from us. Reclaiming it would mean a great deal to goblin kind and to Ranrock. He would be grateful to me should I return it. It seems Ranrock and Rookwood are conspiring. Why would that be? I had heard this, when the dark-hearted conspire, they seldom make their full intentions clear to one another. I can only speculate, but I imagine their alliance is uneasy and quite fragile. Let us hope that ours is less so. Don't suppose you have any idea what could be waiting for me inside the tomb? Considering a dark witch was involved, I suppose there's a chance you may encounter the dark protectors, known as Inferi. The foul creatures thrive on darkness and the cold. Vanquish them with light, force, and most effectively, fire. It all seems clear to me now that we're here. I do hope our alliance proves fruitful. Again, I wish you luck. I will remain here, eagerly awaiting your return. Please, be careful. <laughs> Please, be careful. See ya. Peace. Okay, let's do this. Actually, let's let's fix this uh, spell situation. Mm. I can I can equip a second set, right? There you go. Yeah, this can be my. Uh, 
other set of stuff. Sealed. Moths. Curious. Lumos. Merlin's beard. Quarantine's cracking cloak. This can't be the witch's tomb. Likely I need to go further. Lumos. Yo, yoga pants is going good. Oh, I have two now. I need to find the third butterfly. Just one. I guess we don't get it one at a time. Lumos. I have a feeling I'm not alone here. Zombies. Oh my god, zombies. Or inferior, whatever. There's more. Okay, we're good. A lot of stench. Revelio. Confringo. Good. Give me a wicked more potions. I need that. Revelio. Aha! Uh -huh. Wait, can I not get that? Hmm. Hmm. Wait. Come back for that chest. Confringo. Oh no. Lumos. Hmm. If I could power it somehow, it looks like it could be rotated. Wait, how many butterflies do I need? I have two right here. Depulsor. Okay. Uh Aha. Lumos. 
Now I can use one of you. So far it's intuitive. Revelio. What's that hanging there? Looks precarious. Cabalsa. It's sealed shut from the other side. Down I go. No other way. Hmm. It's over here. Up, oh, time to get rid of some more gear. Probably need Accio. Accio. Yeah. Okay, down the hatch. Two ways to go. Let's go this way. Actually, no, this one goes in a loop. I think. Akio. Oh, we're back here. Wait, right, so what about... No, okay. Oh my god, how many waves? Okay, another puzzle. Revelio. Lumos. This can power the wheel. No, 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 no. Are you serious? I had to jump. Good 
I can not. Parkour that section? Okay. Hey, Katie. Thanks for the raid. Appreciate it. Lumos. Let me go over here. Yo, Chris. What's up? Oh my god. This guy's silly. You have to hit this. I mean, I guess parkour, no. Lumos. Whatever. Like. There we go. I can jump it. Thanks for the good luck. I presume you're farther into this than I am. Lumos. <laughs> nice emote. No? Oh. Well, I do have a lot of assignments to catch up on. I am falling behind on my studies. What's this? Wait, 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 what's this? Well, that was good. Getting distracted by side missions is a good thing. I have not been distracted enough. I'm still falling behind on side missions. Lumos. Wait, what's this? Wait, that's... Oh, wait, 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 that's, I'm, I'm dumb. Uh, 17? Yeah, level 17. Oh, shit. <laughs> I'm like... Lumos. Before the game came out, I'm like, I'm gonna... 100% this game. I'm gonna try to, you know, do this things. More complex. And, Come yeah. Oh, you're f hmm. Oh, oh, I see. You have to put this butterfly. Wait, where did it go? This one. Lumos. Dude, the mount is is amazing. Once you get it, it's. I don't know how I would have traversed the map without it. Honestly. I'll grab this from here. Lumos. Aha! See, there you go. Got it. Yeah, you you need to get them out as soon as you can. Witch's final the time trials are pretty fun too. I did Lord some time trials. The helmet was in her sarcophagus. A dead oh, ash wonder. Your compatriots must have made off with the helmet. Lord God. I to show this to Lodgok. Dun dun dun. Yeah. Like with all the assignments, like I have to like get magic roots and get potions and brew potions is like that ah, takes time. I have to like go to a room requirement or like buy it. Buy them or get like recipes or shit. I know there's a mechanism to open this door. Wait, how did? Okay, how did he know to do that? <laughs> kind of sus. Like, bro, that was, that was not intuitive at all. Lord Gok. The sarcophagus had been raided. I found no helmet, only a dead Ashwinder. Damn, they got here first. We need to get it before Rookwood uses it to further ingratiate himself to Ranrock. I saw one of their campsites not far from here, but I fear you must go in alone. My fighting days are behind me. Yep, I'm pretty much an assassin now. An entire camp of Rookwood's thieves. I might need assistance. Unfortunately, we have no time. 
Get to that helmet before Rookwood does, or we will lose our chance at any leverage, no matter how small, with Ranrock. Yeah, I to found in the those castle. wretched thieves have their hands on such a relic. Before I do that, I actually want to do this Merlin trial while I'm here. Let's see what's up your sleeve this time, Merlin. Revelio. Hmm. What's this? What's this supposed to be? Confringo. Half the battle is figuring out what you're supposed to be doing. Accio. Incendio. Revelio. Expelliarmus. It's not fire. Confringo. Wait, there's moonstone in there. Okay. Um. Do what do I? I'm not sure what to do with these stones. And Guardian? No, I just have Levioso. Levioso. Lumos. Capulso. Glacius. Revelio. Okay, I'm not sure what to do with these ones. Um... What's this? Lumos. Oh, is this it? Aha! I found, figured it out. Okay, we have to find the other. There is one here. I see. I see. Okay, two more. There's one. Marlin himself would be proud. Oh, that was just that was it. It was three. I need to upgrade my gear slots fast. I only have twenty slots still. Anyway, time to use the broom. I should warn you. I won't. Incendia! Confringo! Accio! We will pay for your deeds. Confringo! Confringo! Oh, oh fuck. Expelliarmus! Accio! Expulsion! I'm not seeing more courage than the Warlock! My conductive eye! Stupid! 
Got it, yes. Oh. She think they felt that in London. That was too close. Way too close. Achieve the element. Uh what's this icon? Revelio. It. This is for Rookwood. I shall cast my eyes. Shit. Akio. Confringo. Expelliarmus. Protagon. Come on. Akio. Confringo. Akio. Expelliarmus. Easy. Nobody will believe I defeated an Ashwinder by myself. They disappear. No, why? Dump some gear or equip some gear. I want to sell these ones. Hmm. Still don't know what this icon is. I guess, oh, it has a check note, so okay, that probably means I've completed the camp. It's over here. These rocks have seen better days. Here. 
What do I do with these dead corpses? If only Professor Fake could have seen that. Cool. Uh, how do I get out of here? to make stairs. Telling what lies in wait for me in there. I retrieved the helmet from the Ashwinders. Well done. This is sure to impress Ranrock. The helmet shines even more brightly than I imagined. The etchings, the contour of the profile, remarkable. It looks stunning, Lodgok. I see why you wanted it back. You did the thieves a service by recovering it. I know many a goblin who would have killed for it. Ah, then I am glad to be rid of it myself. Thank you. This should earn Ranrock's trust. I will take it to him immediately. It may distract him from his search. His search? It, uh, it is merely an inkling. You have impressed me greatly, friend. I am glad that I trusted you. We shall speak As soon. As do I. Best to keep our arrangement quiet for now. Many will not believe that our aims might possibly be aligned. How oh, nice to see you, my young friend. Okay. Next. What do we do next? Assume one of these assignments or something. Cast the puzzle on a levitated enemy. Oh, I didn't do that. Why did I not do that? Um, I should find an enemy and do that. Which one is the pulso? Ah, uh, that one, okay. Levitate enemy. Oh, let's go find an enemy. There we go. Levioso! Capulso! Yes! Alright, there you go. Ooh. Inscription. Or a field page. Right Revelio. Aloha hot sea fudge. Interesting. Alright. 
Screw the divinations. Oh, no, that's not divinations. Philip Endo, Philip Endo. I was going Anakin. What are you up to now? Okay, uh, advance time. Accessing the map and pressing right stick. Okay. <laughs> That's just a small detail, don't worry about it. Wow, they're really skimming through this class. Looks like they didn't care about divinations. <laughs> I'll be unrivaled at the next course. I hope those are. I've completed all of my tasks, Professor Onai. Very well done. Although I must admit. I did have something of a premonition that you would follow through. Now, as you have no doubt sharpened your perception by completing my assignment, I am curious, based upon the knowledge that one's present and even one's past may reveal traces of what is to come, what do you see in your own future? I see... Uh, power. I see good things. After all, the future's mine for the taking. And I shall take what I must. Hmm. The future is not etched in stone. It can be carved out by those with very strong wills. And you do seem to possess one. But this talk of tomorrow should not divert us from your present success. I shall inform our good deputy headmistress of your exemplary performance. And if that performance is any omen of what your future may hold, then I, for one, see great things. Channel your magic towards your targets. Descendo. What is what is this for? You have it. Now, why not practice the new spell on the training dummy? Descendo. Oh, they just make him smack <laughs> face on the floor a little. Hmm. <laughs> Okay, well, let's put it back to Thank you. Now, next. Acquire invisibility potion, acquire and use a thunder brew. Do I have thunder brew? Yeah. 
Uh, I have to purchase it. Oh, okay. Purchase the reps recipe. I don't have invisibility potion. Wait, how do I get this? Dog week and death cap. So I gotta go to Hogsmeade, looks like. Rough estimate on 100%? No, I don't. This is a long game. This, this could take a while. Let's just put it that way. Sometimes it seems all roads lead to Hogsmeade. You go to the potion store. Are right you right? Mm -hmm. Come on in. Healing potions are a speciality here, should you need any. I do not have enough, so I'll sell some stuff. Thank you again for delivering those potions to Madame Lawing. Save me a lot of time and trouble. A wise decision. Thank you. Now, visibility potion. Why are these blacked out here? I'm not sure. Eight hundred. Let's buy one. A wise decision. Thank you. Um, is there something else I have to do, Hogsmeade? Right, how do I do this one? Dogweed and death cap. Is that a that's a store, right? But where is where is that store? Dogweed and death cap. Oh, there it is. Dole. Oh, I can't fly here. You can't imagine how inconvenient travel was before I invented blue powder. A oh, Accio. Yeah, page. Revelio. Accio. I have no idea how to open my cat chest. Confringo. Hogs meat. Accio. See another page. Let's go to the challenges menu, 
since I have uncollectible rewards. Oh my god, I do have uncollectible rewards. Oh my god, I <laughs> have so many. <laughs> Just collect all of them at once. That give me actual gear too. My 24 pieces of gear now, so that's better. Come on inside, Revelia. Watch yourself, though. Let's have you leave here alive. You're a force to be reckoned with, um. Hello. Oh, hello. Whew. Sorry I'm in a bit of a tizzy. I was just scolding some of the plants for spitting and nipping. I suppose it's my own fault for putting more than four to a tray. By the way, Beatrice Green is the name, but you may address me as Madam Green. Welcome to Dogweed and Death Cap. Oh, uh, mind you don't knock the mandrakes. Oh, if there wasn't the constant demand for antidotes, I wouldn't need to stock so many of the little deers. Except, of course, for curses. And, well, if you've been petrified, then obviously you've come to the right place. <laughs> Mind you don't knock the mandrakes. Or if there's an uprooting, you'll be the next one to drop dead, and I'm in no mood for a clear-up. Hmm. <laughs> Someone died here. Aye. Fortunate, really, that it was just the one. Now then... How may I help you today? I think I'll just have a look around for now. Very well. Let me know if you see anything you like. What do you have for sale? Well, what say we show you some of what's available? 600. Oh. Oh, and the equips and better items. always open. You be sure to stop by soon. How do I equip a trait slot? Kind of weird. I have to change this again. Oh yeah, I should probably use these again. That. Oh, yeah, that's always good.
Well, what say we show you some of what's available? But your things will be safe with me until they're sold. Then you'll have to make do with money. Shoot, I need money. Doors always open. You be sure to stop by. All right, what else can I do? Spires in Cambridge Tower. I don't know which one it is. Spires, no idea. Oh, thank you for locating for me. Oh, way over there. It's like a place right out of a storybook. Yo, accelerate Liam. How's it going? Oh, hi. How much have you played today? There we go. Welcome, Stas, again. I know what that means. Merlin trial. Ooh, more rocks, more rocks, I see. Rebellion. Now, where are said rocks? Another 10 plus hours, holy shit. Wait, what's your total playtime? It's gotta be like... 40 something hours by now. Oh, I see the bowls. <laughs> I forgot to fall damage. <laughs> I think it's one of those games where it only tracks it when you're unpaused. That's what I think. That's my hypothesis. Accio. Confringo. Accio. Where is it? Where is it? Over here. Oh, here we go. A set of wait, no, that's not a set of of these things. But where? Oh, they were really spread apart. Aha! They're all here. Okay. 
Okay. Uh oh, someone's here. Uh, yes, I picked Ravenclaw. It's what the game gave me. I didn't feel like changing it. I mean, I knew it was going to be Ravenclaw. I would be surprised if it didn't pick me Ravenclaw, to be honest. Every quiz I've ever taken has given me Ravenclaw. Revelio. Dude, so much for these updated drivers supposed to be giving you a better performance. This has like no, had no impact. Is that uh, these balls or is that? No. Revelio. Turn here, maybe. Maybe it's like way up here or something. See a chest. I'll grab the chest. Um. Revelio. There was something else. No, no, no. Ugh. My left bumper is like not... It's like broken a little bit. I really have to smash it to press it. Rebellion. Sure, let's fight it. Incendio. How many spiders are there? Alright, Liam. Good night. Deadly great spider. Protego. Levioso. Uh, don't know what this chest is for. Revelio. Oh. Depulsa. Maybe? Akio. I don't know, I'm guessing here. No. Akio. 
I just want to find the other stones. Where are the other stones? All right, dark. Have a good night. Why is it locking me in here? Yo, Kane! With the raid. Appreciate it, dude. How's it going, man? It's been a long time no see. Wizarding is a going, as you can see. I am dressed as Etsu at the Tori da Firenze. Playing wizard, assassin turned wizard. Um, uh, currently stuck on this puzzle though. How's it going, dude? Lumos. Revelio. Doing what's called a Merlin's trial. And can't find the third set of rocks. That would need to go here. Hey, Jamie, are you still here? Can you, uh, I would like a backseat here because I'm taking way too long on this trial. And I thought it was these things, but they don't give me anything. Am I even able to complete this? I might not even be able to complete this. Yeah, the two was obvious. Revelio. Oh my god. Why was I not seeing this? I was not seeing this. Wait, 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 wait. I was not seeing this on the on the map. You. Oh my God! My draw distance was not high enough. Yo, what is this? Yo, oh my God! <laughs> what? Dude, I just proxied. No way. No way. That was sick. That was sick. <laughs> Bro. That was... I just launched myself. I think I cast the pulse. So yeah, I did cast the pulse. So. Oh, so if I draw a distance, I, I could not see it. That was dumb. I agree with Liam. No, now I'm gonna do, now I'm gonna do these two again. I've been I've spent so much time on this moment trial. It's not even funny. Oh, so I found what was already found. I see. That's sick. That's a sick launch. I'm glad that's found. Definitely uses for that.
so tricky after all, Marlin. Okay. Now we can move on to the next place. You can use this carefully scaled towers. Good, good. Hmm. Seems a pleasant enough little place. Oh. No. <laughs> Excuse me. Uh, please hit this balloon. That's it. Let's go. Actually, I'm gonna get. I'm gonna get out of there. Let's go back to Hogwarts. Yo, Papuko. Yes, I am winning. By winning, I mean very slowly. This game is massive. I'll probably have to wait till daytime to do this. Oh no, she's here. Welcome back. Have you finished your assignment? Reporting back, Professor. Assignment's all finished. Well done. Shows good discipline. Wisdom is a golden snitch, as they say. And you're proving a skilled seeker in that regard. Let us practice our restore momentum. A charm, incidentally, created to stop quaffles from plumbing straight to the it? ground during a Quidditch match. Precise, deliberate movements. Also, it's shape of an M, I guess, for momentum. Slows the movement of the objects. Okay. Very good. Arrest the momentum. That's it. Keep it up. Sick. Okay. Now to equip that back. All right, more assignments. I need money. That's what I need. Um. Wait, I have the recipe, do I? Uh, let's go back to the room requirement. Secrets. There's my Didney plant. Let's change it. Oh wait, I can't I can't make anything else. Okay. Nothing to identify. For now at least. Uh Thunderbrew. Missing ingredients. Shriveling fruit shrivel fig fruit. I did not know that. Uh, Go back to Hogsmeade, I guess. Maybe I'll have enough to buy a third brew potion out, right? Hogsmeade, here I come. Hello there. 
Thank you again for delivering those potions to Madame Lawing. Save me a lot of time and trouble. No, I don't. Do I have... Can you buy the shrivel something something? Nope. I hope Wait, to let me see equip you this. Every time I change it, I have to reset my appearance. I wish I could just set it and forget it. What can I do for you today? Still short, so I'll... I hope to see you again. Wait, can I buy a Venomous Tentacular now? You can't imagine how inconvenient travel was before I invented blue powder. I'll put the cat right here. Quite convenient that these shops are open 24-7, basically. Oh, hello. Careful of the mandrakes. I haven't fed them yet. Oh, I'm always thrilled when a young one makes a wise purchase. Mandrake. I don't think I have a mandrake. You'll go far. Mandrake seeds. Any mandrake seeds? Well, what say we show you some of what's available? Eight hundred. Nope, I don't have that. Doors always open. All right, let's go do time trial, I guess. Oh, it's right here. Sometimes it seems all roads lead to Hogsmeade. from your latest flight. I want to hear all the particulars. Good news, Mr. Weeks. With your upgrade, I was able to set a new record at the Irondale course. Brilliant! I knew the upgrade had fantastic potential. How did your broom feel? It rides well. It does get a tad shaky at top speed, and the handle wobbles a bit when I hit a strong gust of wind. Ah, yes. Hmm, I see. I think I know how to address that. Thank you. I owe you one. If it means another upgrade, the pleasure's all mine. You sound as determined as I am to improve broom flight. It's a joy to have a collaborator like yourself. If I'm right, and I do hope I am, you'll be hearing good news from me soon. Thank you again, truly. Mr. Weeks and I do make a good team.
Don't think I've explored this side of the castle yet. Oh, you know, I I I I want to talk to this guy. It's me, Gareth. Do you have a moment? Were you calling me, Gareth? I was. After you helped me with that fupa feather and potions, I reckoned you might be just the person I need. You see, I have an idea for a fizzing wisby inspired beverage, but I'm missing a key ingredient. Where do you find time for this and your homework? I've plenty of time for both. Been managing for years. So, I suspect the key ingredient in fizzing whisbies is dried billywig stings. I heard there's a store of them in Honeyduke's cellar. I'd get them myself, but my Aunt Matilda has her eye on me. Thinks I need to focus on potions class for a while, not for my own bruise. I was hoping you could follow a secret passage to Honeyduke's cellar and grab a few dried billywig stings for me. Of course. You never know when you might need a quick means of escape from the castle. Brilliant. Thank you. But you should know that it's not exactly quick. It's the secret bit that's helpful. The passage is hidden behind the statue of a one-eyed witch in the third floor corridor. Just tap it with your wand and say, Descendium. I'll see what I can do, Gareth. Fair enough. You shall be the first one to taste my newest brew if you can be of help. Perhaps I can convince a meat to help me with my potions homework. Get my aunt to loosen her reins a bit. Okay, okay. I'll need to get those dried billywigs things for Gareth if he's to finish his latest concoction. Accurate! One of those witch statues shouldn't be too hard to find. Leviosa! Where did the where did the snitch go? Oh, here he is. Come on. Thank you. Okay, there was another quest here somewhere. Oh, excuse me. There's another one. Where is the snitch? Might I trouble you for a moment of your time? Depulsa. No, no, no. Akio. Rebellion. This looks like the right statue. Now, what was the password? Hold on, I want to get the snitch. Or the key, not the snitch.
Downstairs? Probably downstairs. Off on another adventure, are we? No. I hear it from here, but I don't see it anywhere. Revelio. Back to you later. I don't know where that snitch that key is. Descendium. Goodness. Who knew this was all down here? Revelio. A lift. Must be how I get down. Looks broken though. Don't worry, we'll use a paro for the first time in like forever. Confringo. Repairer. That seems to have done the trick. This castle will never cease to surprise me. Feels like Indiana Jones right now. Confringo! Revelio! I'm trapped. How am I supposed to get out of here? Confringo! Oh. Wait, I'm back here. I went in a circle. Revelio. Leviosa Glacius. Did it work? Aha, that worked. Nice. I'm going to have to get past this. Leviosa Glacius. Levioso! Repairer! Levioso! Glacius! Levioso! Revelio! There's things down there.
Repair her. Confringo. One more to go and I'll make it across. Leviosa. Something's getting in the way of that platform. Repair her. Capulsa. Accio. Levioso. That did the trick. Indeed it did. Revelio. This must be the way out. I need to find a way to open that gate. Duelist attire, okay. Close to honey jukes. Um. Revelio. Does it get any more cozy than Hogsmead? Honey jukes. I can smell the chocolate. Now, where would I find the dried billywig stings for Gareth? I have the dried billywig stings. Now, back to Gareth. I can only imagine how his new recipe is going to turn out. Upstairs, okay. It's not locked. Okay, now it's locked. Butterflies were attracted to treasure. What they missed that one in beasts. What? What are you up to now? Hello, Gareth. I have those dried billywigs things. You got them? Incredible. I need some money, honestly. I am broke. I'm sorry, Gareth. Getting them was more work than I expected. I'd like to be paid for my time. Of course. Didn't think it would be that much trouble, but I'm happy to pay for your help. Thank you again. I'll let you know when I brewed my first batch of fizzing whiz beer. How much? How much do I get paid, is it gonna say? 300! Oh, I need to do start doing that more often. Oh my god. That's amazing.
Revelio. Levioso. Revelio. Where are you guys coming from? I just deloaded the map. What? <laughs> um. Okay. That's not cool. That's crazy. That's actually crazy. That is not useful. Whatsoever. Is that consistent? Let's see if that's consistent. And if so, they will have to patch that. No. Okay, I guess it just happens. Revelio. <laughs> That's crazy. So they added a uh, side door to it. Revelio. Mm -hmm. All right, where's a butterfly? You know, place it. It's good. Game is good. So much shit in this game. Assassin. Trained to kill wizards. Hey, what? Revelio found you. Really? I can't jump over this? But I can fall through the map and die. That's brutal death. Hello again, Mr. Moon. Oh, I was hoping to see you again, my young friend. Uh, Gladwin Moon, Hogwarts caretaker, at your service. First, uh, please allow me to apologize if I seemed a bit uh, unsteady when we last met. I'm afraid I had a rather disconcerting encounter. Although I hear your visit to Hogsmeade was even more eventful than mine. I suppose you could call it eventful. 
I certainly wasn't expecting a troll attack. Oh, of course not. Uh, and from what I understand, the village was lucky you were there. In fact, my recent visit to Hogsmeade is the reason I was hoping to bump into you. I could use your help with something. Do you see that curious statue over there? Watch what happens when that light changes from day to night. I just waited from night to day. What the heck? If you wouldn't mind humoring me for a moment, see if you can remove the moon from the statue. Oh, odd little contraptions, aren't they? It seems the statue vanishes once the moon is removed, which, incidentally, can only be done at night. Uh, why don't you hold on to that one for now, and I'll explain more as we walk. Uh, ever since that fateful day in the village, those curious statues have begun appearing about the castle. A fair number have been strewn around Hogsmeade. Someone, it seems, is trying to torment me. You see, that day in Hogsmeade, I turned a corner and came face to face with a boggart, or, or shapeshifter, if you will, uh, which takes the form of whatever scares you most. And this one took the form of a demiguise. A demiguise? <gasps> yes! Terrifying creature that can see the future. Wholly unnerving. I encountered one when I was a lad in Korea. Terrible experience. Uh, those statues are temporizes. The moons, I assume, are an uninspired play on my name. Some jackanapes used a boggart to learn my greatest fear and use it against me. I have my suspicion as to the scoundrel or scoundrels responsible. It is my hope that they will slip up and reveal themselves as the statues disappear. That is why I need your help in removing the statues. Why me? A couple of reasons, frankly. Uh, first, your daring do against those trolls in Oxmede has gained you a reputation for fearlessness. Second, as macabre and hideous as a demiguise is, most would find my fear of them unwarranted. You, however, have seen how they affect me. I'm at my wit's end, young friend. I simply oh, can't is? bring nice. myself to go near them. In fact, I know of two statues right here in the faculty tower. Perhaps you could start simply by yeah, I've also streaming again. so uh, I can go about my evening duties. I don't know if we found enough though to make this run like not super long. What's in it for me? Why would I do this? Oh, Seems all risk and no reward. Oh, rest assured, there's very little risk, and there is in fact a reward. I will teach you a particularly useful spell. Uh, first, you know how to cast a disillusionment charm, correct? Hmm. You'll want to do that before wandering the tower at night. Uh, Dude, next, runs are, it could be like a long, long run. I don't know However, why people are asking about them, honestly. Alahor. The game's good. No, the game's great. But what's about curfew? Curfew? 100% is going to be a bitch, though. So. I sent you a bit like me when I was your age. It's probably going to take a, a while to route it, let alone do runs. And I took advantage of it. Oh, everyone loved me for it. <laughs> oh, those were the days. Uh, now, you'll find one I mean, statue it's, in the prefect you experience a game you experience, a game you explore, a game you Good luck. take in. Oh, and thank you. Well, the appeal. I mean, yeah. That could be the case for a lot of things, you know. We're finally learning the Alhamora spell. Thank goodness. Alohomora. Rotate the dials until both ports gunning are activated to release the block.
Right. Well, I really had to hold it there. I was like, why is it taking so long? Well done! You're in! Remember, use a disillusionment charm so no one claps eyes on you. This is a restricted area of the castle, after all. Thanks. Expelliarmus! The loot. Revelio. What's this? Oh, more of this. More notes. Professor Figure, receipt of your most recent owl, blah 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 blah. Ferris Bavin, Ministry of Minister of Quidditch final. Don't you be tempting me with Quidditch. Revelio. Level two lock. Okay. Can't do that. Revelio. Can't pick this lock. No. Let's go upstairs. Rather poorly, I'd say. Is that so? Uh, we're raising a generation. I said it has to be a page.
to. Oh no. I was caught. Uh, but I got the reward, right? It should save me there. Oh, nope. I have to restart this. Oh, they're not here. Still can't pick it. Revelio. Revelio. This must be the prefect's bathroom. Oh my god. Over here. Shoot. I know where you are. I gotta. Hi, you're leaving. Nope, nope, nope. Move. You go. Revelio. Oh, you're right there. Huh, you just turned quickly. No way. Revelio. Bro, this is not fair. And you go over here and then. I should begin my rounds now. The boss.
Where's the page? There's a page here. Revenue. Going to learn the Quidditch rules. It's a majestic sport. Hmm. Revelio. Yeah, well, I already failed it twice, butters, but it looks like I am able to complete this right now. Oh, I need that. You are in my way. Fuck you. I don't like this. Why. I don't want to be too much for sneaking. Well, come on. This is a bedroom. Whose bedroom is this? Revelio. Please tell me you went away. You're really covering the front door. Oh my god. <laughs> Holy shit. Hello, Mr. Moon. I have the moons you asked me to collect. Oh goodness, you're as fearless as I'd hoped. An excellent start. Uh, if that's we a crazy more, cool, that's a cool find. Shed some light on who's behind all this. Of course, I first suspected Peeves, he drove the previous caretaker, rancorous carp, to an early retirement with his intolerable buffoonery. But that does not explain the bogger in Oxmead, does it? No. I am determined, with your help, to discover the identity of my tormentor. It's definitely intriguing. I'd like to help you solve this mystery. You, my friend, are a gentle person and a, a scholar. And I have something to offer in exchange for your assistance. Now, remember, the moons are only retrievable at night. Thus, I encourage you to use a disillusionment when necessary. Okay. Yes, I am going full Assassin's Creed on this game, yep. Understood. I shall keep an eye out. I appreciate that. Oh, I, I knew you were the one to ask for help. Uh, keep at it so we can solve this mystery. Only well, we four more, actually, house tokens. Nice. Mm. 
Yeah, I still need to get those potions. Hello, friend. I wonder if you might stop by the three broomsticks when you can. I would like your help with something. So you have two new As ones. I mentioned, my sister Anne misses Hogwarts, and she hasn't been herself lately. I'd like to take you up on your promise to visit her with me. I'm heading to Feldcroft soon, so I'll look forward to seeing you there. It's just south of Hogwarts. By the way, hope you're faring well with the blasting curse. It's still one of my favorites. Now that you've attended Beast's class, I've asked Deke to assist you in using the room to further your studies in that regard. Please meet him there when you can. Oh, now I can... I've not heard from my uncle stuff. Roland in quite some time. I've been beside myself with worry. Could you meet me in the courtyard? So many mail. Okay, um... Whoa. Where is this? Uh, yeah, I guess it's just completing more of the story. Lumos. Aha. That's pretty cool. Okay, we're b back to this thing. What does this thing do? Aha, uh -huh, I need the pulso to open it. Pour some mead, will ya? Revelio. Oh, butterfly moment. Lumos. Confringo. Revelio. This is another bathroom. Some more coin. I can unlock this. Hello, Hamora. Out of order bathroom. Revelio. Aha. Uh -huh. Mine now, demi guys. Five more demi guys. Secret stole. It was out of order. It was all good. Okay, there's so many more of these. Side quest must do them all. I cannot do this for all eternity. You make your point. Uh, ah! Behind me. 
Adelaide Oaks, isn't it? I received your owl. Yes, I'm Adelaide Oaks. Oh dear. You see, my uncle Roland is a metal trader who's quite well known in the goblin community. He normally sends me owls every week when he's on his business travels. In his last owl, he alluded to dealings with those radical goblins, Ranrock's loyalists. It's been ages since that owl and I'm worried. What with the troll attack on Hogsmeade and the rumours that goblins may have been involved, well, I'm fearing the worst. Should I be worried about my uncle, or am I overthinking this? I think you're right to be concerned, Adelaide. Your uncle may be in trouble. You're much more understanding than Professor Weasley. She heard I was going to look for him and forbade me from leaving the grounds. She's convinced he can handle himself, but I can't concentrate on anything until I know he's all right. I... Ugh. Could you try to find out for me? From what I hear, you're almost as adventurous as Uncle Roland. Has your uncle traded with many goblins? Yes, for ages. Even speaks gobbledygook. But he only recently mentioned... Ranrock's lot. Insisting the galleons were worth the risk. He does it for me. Between robes and supplies, attending Hogwarts costs a fair sickle. And besides that, Uncle Roland has expensive taste. He's sacrificed so much for me over the years. I promised him that as soon as I finish Hogwarts, I shall be the one taking care of him. I take it you and your uncle are close? We are. My mother died when I was born, and I lost my father when I was five. Uncle Roland's Damn, looked after bro. me for as long as I can remember. He knows I get anxious when he travels, and that's why he sends me all the owls. To let me know that he's all right. I'll try and look into it for you, Adelaide. Thank you. He's very thorough in his record keeping, notes all his trades in a journal, makes maps. In fact, in his last owl, he drew me a map of his next stop. He planned to set up camp north of here. I do hope you're able to find out where he is. Thank you again for any help you can provide. Wait, um, can I? No, I'm just gonna fly. I hope Adelaide's Uncle Roland is all right. She seems very worried. Adelaide mentioned her uncle's camp maybe near Brockborough. Yeah, I think we're gonna play this quest and then I think I'm gonna call it for a night. Some people waiting for me. I'm gonna play some games, some other games. Hopefully, this is quick. This be Mr. Oaks's campsite. And Rob's loyalists just ahead. Incendiary. I won't rest. You can't stop us. Protego. I will make you pay. Confirm. I won't rest until 
now to find out what happened here. Mr. Oaks's trade journal. Revelio. Mr. Oaks's trade journal. Accio. Confringo. Got some secret in here. Wait. Oh, that wasn't it. Revelio. said that her uncle kept notes of his trades, maps. Perhaps these landmarks will lead me to him. Follow his trail. I need to look at the thing map. Down the creek to something, something. This map. Now to find the crooked tree. A crooked tree, just as the map said. The crumbling tower shouldn't be far from here. Found its crumbling tower. And the crumbling tower. The spot on the map should be directly south of it. Directly south. South, for sure. Castle must have been quite stately in its time. What do we have here? Accio, Confringo, Incendio. Okay, I'm actually gonna. Higher up in the keep. I think it's too long. We'll have to finish this later.